Right, so what we have here is a hub motor that I've just gone and put way bigger phase wires on. This was the original down there. It's my modded original. The one before that was just way thinner. This is the one I've got on there now. It's bloody huge. This motor has actually been rewound for Delta, which means more power and more speed. This is a one kilowatt motor. Stock it already drew just, just about nearly two kilowatts. I haven't power tested it yet, but it used to spin really slowly. I've only got um, focus, focus. One moment. That's very terrible to see. You can't see that at all. Let's just show you another screen then. Only got 46 volts in there. And this is how fast it used to spin. And it used to spin a little faster than that. That's how fast it used to spin. Now, we've got this. Try myself think is absolutely ridiculous speed wise. These breakers don't serve a purpose, I'm just using them as junction blocks because I couldn't find anything else, but yeah, this thing has been rewired for Delta. I haven't tested it on a bike yet as just say last time the fork didn't fare all that well. Magnesium fork, I might set this on fire at some point, it could be quite fun. But yes, this is the fork I'm going to be using now. This is a metal. This is, no, it's all metal. This is a steel fork, which means they're much, much stronger. You can take much more abuse like the hub motor throws at it. But yes, that was just a quick demonstration of the motor. I'm just going to show you what it runs at full power. I'm only taking about 500 watts for acceleration. Throttle works fine on this. Keeping out of 500 watts. Now you can't see the current annoyingly because it's that annoying. There we go, nearly. Yeah, I can't be bothered, so I'll just read off what it says. Drawing 13 amps at most at top current. Which isn't that much, really. 15 amps peak current. You've got 675 watts peak. That there, that quick test just used 2.4 watt hours. It's not too bad actually. But anyway. This is not the motor I'm going to be using. I'm basically going to be building a stealth bomber e-bike, but unloaded top speed of 130 miles an hour. Muxus 3K V3 turbo on the back. This is a front motor, so this is this is not going to go on there, this is just a quick test. I, the, what, I ripped the wires when I ripped the forks, so I thought I'd quickly wire it for Delta and see how it's like. And apparently it's very terrifying. I'll be riding this thing tomorrow, see how fast I can get it to go. But yeah, that's that.